Greetings, Faith Family. Thank you for joining me on this Wednesday update. We have a lot of things going on this week, so I want to share some of that with you today. Tomorrow we have senior lunch. It's 1130 at Lux Cafe. If you know you're going, RSVP to the church office uh, today so we can make a, a reservation with Lux Cafe tomorrow. But that's tomorrow at 1130. On Friday, we have parent night out from 6 to 7.30 here at the church. And so if you have kiddos at home and you want to drop them off at the church and go out for a little bit, parents' night out Friday, which is also St. Patrick's Day, from 6 until 7.30. On Saturday, we're continuing Lenten breakfasts. We're uh, joining several churches in our area and having Lenten breakfasts at these particular churches for fellowship, um, to hear a little bit about what's going on in our community or in those churches. And so on this Saturday, we are going to Jamestown United Methodist Church, 830. Now it's gonna be here a week from Saturday, so on March 25th, if you'd like to join us, mark it on your calendars, Linton Breakfast here at Faith, but this Saturday, Jamestown United Methodist, Methodist Church. Also this coming Sunday, we're continuing a sermon series in which we are looking at the heart of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. And we've been looking at how Jesus described his own heart as gentle and lowly. And I've been looking at that word lowly as approachable. Jesus is approachable. Well, this Sunday we're, we're looking at how Jesus' heart is also, it's beautiful, it's lovely. And I truly believe what attracted people to Jesus was his beautiful heart and how he reached out with compassion to the world around him. There's nothing in the scriptures to indicate that outwardly um, Jesus was beautiful. The, the scriptures actually tell us it was kind of the opposite. If you'd like to hear more, come and worship with us on Sunday, but we're looking at the heart of Jesus Christ and how it's beautiful and how reached out and how Jesus reached out to us with compassion and with love. A couple of other things I want to let you know about. First of all, we do have our fall forms available for our bus trip. And this, this year, one of the main things we are doing is we're taking a cruise in the mighty Mississippi. So while we, while we start on a bus, we will get on a uh, river cruise, and uh, we hope that you can join us. And there's a lot of great stuff that we'll be doing in addition to the river cruise. Wonderful fellowship, awesome food, and really some neat attractions that are... Uh, that are scheduled into this bus trip. But again, it's September 13th through the 15th. If you'd like to know more information, again, these are at the welcome desk. It's $762 uh, per person, uh, double our occupancy. But again, more information at the welcome desk. Also, if you'd like to order an Easter lily for, for Easter, they are $11 a piece and the deadline is March 27th. You can find forms in our main hallway. Um, that, uh, that you can order, order those Easter lilies. Well, I hope you have a great day today. I hope you have a great St. Patrick's Day on, on Friday and that you can join us here in worship on Sunday. Let us close in a word of prayer. Most gracious God, we thank you for the season of Lent as we come to you with open hearts. Dear God, we thank you for the heart of Jesus Christ, that it is gentle, it is lowly, it is beautiful, it is lovely. We thank you for the way in which he reaches out to us with compassion, mercy, and grace. And so, dear God, during this season of Lent, we remember how you, how you chase after us and how we, um, how we can have abundance and everlasting life through Jesus Christ. And we thank you for all that you're doing for us. Dear God, I pray for all of those who are at home today, all, all of those who are watching this, um, wherever they might be. Dear God, I pray that you'll touch their heart in a very special way and you will draw them closer unto you. Dear God, we thank you for this day. We thank you for your love and grace. And it's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless. Have a wonderful day. Great St. Patrick's Day on Friday.